Hello friends, I'm Colonel Failure and welcome back to Kiki Tyrant and the Budget Stellars. Uh, yeah, we won the Battle of the Bands. Yeah, that's the thing that happened. That occurred. That's, uh, yeah, that's, that's the thing that, that happened there. Um, right, let's have a look at the calendar. Uh, we're playing gigs tonight. Well, tomorrow night, uh, Friday night, we've, uh, we've got a Battle of the Bands at uh, Jones Watery Hole in, uh, in Chicago, Illinois. Uh, and then on Saturday, we've got uh, Battle of the Bands at Drew's Bar. Uh, and Grill uh, in Chicago, Illinois. Uh, and then we got a, we got a week off. Now, if I can if I can nail one of those, that'd be great because uh, today the intention is to uh, to record uh, some sort of disc based recording or something. I've no idea. Now then, looking at the old set list here. Uh, it's not it's not brilliant. Uh, our familiarity has has dropped a little bit, and uh, and something by Coldplay is not yet up to the standard that I would be uh, I would be happy to play it. So I'm not wholly certain what my set list is going to be. Uh, no ho ho ho! I have no. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going with that. Right, let's go to the gig, shall we? Let's go dominate all who uh, who lie before us. Where's the door? I, I, I live here. I should know. That's a that's the thing that should occur. All right. Okay. We're 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 rolling. Um. Right. Spin it around. Off with Trundle. Yeah. Uh, Troy's printing needs some help. Plenty of printing places need help, but it's a it's a right faff. Uh, I'd rather make my money by dominating the battles of the bands. Uh. I mean, even if I were to uh, to work five days a week, out of the seven, obviously, because you don't want to work seven days a week. Where where's the fun in that? No. Uh, we would still make more money from the battles of the bands if we were to win them reliably. Of course, we've got to get... Whoop, gently does it. Uh, we've got to get invited to such things. But, uh, you know, I feel uh, I feel modestly confident that uh, that we can win one or two. Although, uh, this gig will uh, may, may well uh, dictate that. Evening, Joan. How's it going? Have a good gig. Thanks, I intend to. You know, if you record some CDs mm -hmm. to sell during gigs, yeah. folks can take you home with them. It, uh, well, I, I assume that's figuratively speaking, uh, but yeah, no, well, I mean that's the plan, Joan. But we've got to win here tonight, because uh, uh, all right, there, uh, you're a bit matchy, matchy, aren't you? Well, I mean, yeah, I mean it's allowed, I suppose. Check this dude's hair, but then he's wearing skin-tight trousers, and he just got to go. Oh no, man, no, no, it's just not, it's not a good look. Uh, right, play the gig. Now then. We're a, so, uh, we're a set list. Now, this is the uh, the set list that got us all the accolades last time around. Uh, accolades, lots of them. Count them. There were several. Uh, Rad Pope. Well, we can't not, really, can we? I mean, we know it. Uh, that, I mean, that's a good, good place to start. <sighs> Dare I take it out of the set list? No! Rad Pope is our opening gambit. Always will be, and therefore... I've made that rod for my own back. Uh, right, now we did Hey June second last time around. Good tune, good tune, good tune. Um, and then uh, Smells Like Stella. So, so tune. All right, yeah. Uh, she Sells Sanity, the hitter. That's what that is. Uh, Tonky the Space Gobbler is a 10. Mm, yeah. Uh, and uh, Nice Hair to finish them off. It's a good set list. I mean, who am I, who am I kidding? I mean, I've... Until I bring uh, Carpal Flyover and something by Coldplay online, uh, there's uh, or Barney's Lament, uh, you know, uh, homage to the purple dinosaur. Um, you know, it's uh, I think I think we're there. I think we're on it. I think we're good. I think we're there. I think we're I think we're there. I think. Good evening, Wembley. Yeah, we are Kiki Tyrant and the Budget Stellars. Uh, yeah, I know the the name's going through something of uh, of an evolution. Hope you like it. Check um, the new sunglasses. New sunglasses, everybody. Yeah, you should appreciate those. They're they're pretty good. Uh, look at look at Stella throwing the shapes. Well, throwing a shape. She seems to be shadow boxing people in the uh, in the audience there. Uh, it's, it's pretty good. Uh, the audience energy level pretty strong. Audience interest level less less strong. Okay, well, I mean, we'll we'll see where we get to. I think we did all right. I think we I think we might have nailed this one. I think uh, I think this one might come up uh, come up our way. Seventy five people in the audience. I'm feeling t-shirts. Wait for it. Wait for it. 
Wait for ah, angry hospital, angry budget. Ah, oh, what a load of rubbish. Crowd must have gotten paid today because uh, the business uh, merchandise counter was busier than usual tonight. Roger that. Okay, a couple of from the uh, pointy owner. Uh, four members of Waits Beside the Voice. What? Uh, one member of Knowledge Before the Name. Um, two members of Throat. Uh, we, do, we do like a bit of Throat. Uh, two members of Brilliant Scale. One from Respects in the Country. Uh, and uh, one member of the band, or no, the Poor Queens. Two members of the band Wax. Uh, one member from The Responsible Dog. Two members from Religion. Uh, one member from Sassy Reigns. Uh, that's a name. Uh, two members of the band Attractive Baskets. Uh, no, that's all right. And uh, two members of uh, The Broad Learnings. Snore. Uh, okay, well, we had 34 fans in the audience. They're all in other bands, but yeah, hey, it's, hey it can't be, can't be too bad. Uh, relationship with people has, uh, has gone up, and we sold three T-shirts. Good. We didn't make much, though, did we? Let's uh, analyse the set list. Yep. They enjoyed that one, 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 and uh, that one seemed to be all right. Well, I'm not going to lie, people. I'd, uh, I'm a smidge disappointed. Uh, that we didn't do better there. Second place is all right. It shows that we've got we've got a bit of progress on the go, uh, but uh, it shows that we've still got some some way to go. Hold on, what's, why are you telling me about the gig that we just left? I haven't got anything else on today. We've played it. Yeah, no, we've do, we've done here. Take me home. Oh, how do you go? I just just take the quick route. Now I have leveled up. That's a good sign. Now then, what would be the smart move here? More stage presence, uh, as we've got another Battle of the Bands tomorrow, and therefore it might push us over the top. I like it. All right, I was going to put some in songwriting, you know, because we, we need to be able to write better songs, but uh, ultimately uh, winning Battles of the Bands uh, will do us good. Anyway, you know what I want to do as soon as I come home from a Battle of the Bands? That's right, I want to do a bit of practice, because uh, we came second, not first. Right then, let's let's push everything back over the top, apart from a song about it all and put it down, Brenda, because uh, uh, they've been rejected from the uh, from the song list. Time to go to the bar. I'm not feeling it, you know. I don't think we should bother practicing that one. So let's not. Uh, let's not bother with Carpool and Barney. Uh, you know, we need six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One of these. Oh no. Okay, well, we either get all these back up to tippity top, yeah, or we focus. We're not going to get Coldplay to to ninety plus. That's that's a thing that isn't going to happen. Oh, the dilemma! Oh, oh my goodness! Oh, what are we going to do? Just just do just practice all of them. All right, okay. Uh, just a day, please. We've got a gig tomorrow. All right, yeah. Go on, fire it up. Sweet. Uh, how do we get on there? Like, not great. Uh, no, it wasn't, was it? No, I should have put everything in the cold plate. Well, you didn't, did you? Stella's still sparkly. Oh, good for her. And she's inspired. Oh, hold on. Um, and, uh, well, at least Stella's inspired. I'm inspired as well. Uh, uh, Stella isn't inspired, but Stella is. So uh, so I think, yeah, yeah, we should get to uh, write a song. What you got for me? Um, bit thin on the old melodies there, but we have got some in the kitty. Uh, what I'd really like, though, is to take advantage of this level four. Oh, hold on, what about a level eight rhythm section? Uh, let's start with that. Yes. Okay, and then have you got anything that goes with it? What about lyrics? We've got two-point lyrics. It's not great. Yeah, but that already takes it to a ten-point song. If we can finish the song here, it could be a winner. We've got a one-point riff and a one-point melody to go with it, if we're lucky. I'm very disappointed. Yeah, I mean, you should be. And yeah, I'm just terrifically disappointed. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, well, look, how about we chuck out these lyrics, right? Throw them away, right? And we'll have these ones instead. Uh, because we know that those lyrics will interact with that rhythm. That that gives us a, a foundation point on which a, uh, uh, a harpoon-level song can be delivered. I mean, it's tempting to grab uh, these level three lyrics here, but uh, I'm not gonna do that. 
Hey up, Drew. How's it going? Have a good gig. Thanks. You know, if you record some CDs mm. to sell during gigs, folks yes. can take you home with them. Yeah, I, yeah, I, uh, I've, I may have heard that before. Uh, are you sure we've practiced enough for tonight? We've practiced the heck out of these tunes, Stella. You know them. All right, uh, vote budget. Yeah, get get pumped for budget. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Good evening, Wembley. We are Kiki Tyrant and the Budget Stellar. Look at the audience energy level. Holy moly. They got well into Rad's Pope. The thing is, they start burning the energy too quick. They set off too fast. It's like Dancing to the Passenger by Iggy Pop. Uh, you forget that it's like a five and a half minute song. You start away, you're jigging away there. And by about three minutes in, you're going flipping it. This is a mission. Uh, yeah, no, it's true. It's not as bad, though, as, uh, as trying to pull off the same to uh, to Temple of Love by the Sisters of Mercy uh, and then realising that actually they're playing the dance mix that is 14 minutes long and you go, oh no, I am I am not going to make it through to the end of this one now admittedly this is not activity I've conducted in the last 15 or 20 years hang on over 20 years, oh crikey probably about 25 years, oh flipping heck yeah, ah, oh, I need to get back into dancing I think. anyway, how do we do? come on, come on, come on, come on come on, come on Go on! Yes! 81 people in the crowd. The audience was slightly entertained by our performance. A group of hecklers made it very difficult to perform. That's good. Yeah, still one though. Huh? Yeah. In your face, ball. And dark interest and sound acts. You suck. Right, who's in? The pointy owner? Yeah, waits beside the voice we're in again. Uh, knowledge before the name. Uh, annoying doors, throat, uh, a brilliant scale, uh, respects in the country, the poor queens, angry hospital, uh, the greybacks, oh those, those jokers, uh, cat in the island, uh, the responsible dog, religion, sassy reigns, uh, the broad learnings uh, and able, and we just made two large, sweet, we only sold two t-shirts, come on, we must surely have done better than that, we're very happy though. Are we nearly there yet? I reckon we must be. Sweet. How do they like to say it? Yep, 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 yep. Good. Right, okay, perfect. Uh, now, I've got five I've got five G's locked in, uh, written down. I'm going to go find... Well, maybe not now. It's probably closed. Um, I don't, in fact, let's just go home. I've got, uh, I've got something else to hang in my trophy cabinet. Uh, there we go. Right. How do you, how do you, oh, it's up here, look. There you go, uh, Drew's, Drew's Bar and Grill. Yeah. Yeah, I wanna, I wanna slap this one on the wall. Yep, that'll do, perfect, al don't know, that'll do, perfect alignment. Oh, look at it. I mean, it looks like it's made out of expensive, but it's not, it's just hung up with blue tack. Um, it's all, no, no, put it, put it. There you go, done, yes exactly as I want it. I am going to plaster this wall with everything that we win. Yeah. And I'll put the first gold disc we get in the Kazi. Right then. Uh, what I like to do when getting home from a gig is uh, practice, practice, practice. Um, now, we're up to 99 on those. Let's get Coldplay over the line, right? And then we can just, we can just rehearse what would be the next set list. Because uh, if I recall correctly, uh, we've got a uh, we've got another battle of the bands next weekend, and uh, it would be super to win it. Okay, right now then, I've I've finished my practice. Something by Coldplay is coming right along. Now you're talking, uh, but we're going to go out to the recording studio. Now I've absolutely no idea how much this is going to cost. I'm pretty certain it's going to be a ruddy delight when I find out, uh, and that I will be in no way disconsolate vis-a-vis -vis, uh, the, the, the cost of the whole flipping heck. Marty's or Aiden's? Well, uh, Marty uh, did uh, invent Chuck Berry sound, so uh, I'll, I reckon he might do something. Right. Okay, so uh, producer budget gets us nine points, or we can change a producer, which will cost us 70 quid an hour. Okay. Um, how, many, how many songs do we need then? 
Oh, interesting. After recording some songs, you must choose which recording to put on a CD. Uh, when the CD has all the songs you want, release it. <laughs> oh, this is very exciting. Um, yeah, all right. Some of these songs are rubbish. Yeah. Uh, Stella's negotiated 3% off. Uh, well done, Stella. Um, I don't know. Should we pay for a good producer or should we put this out as an edgy at first album for cheap? Um, well, I mean, let's be honest here. The songs suck. Uh, what are you talking about? All right, maybe they don't. Um, yeah, um, yeah, hold on. We've got uh, Doug Clough, who's got 56 kilos and is 100 quid now. Okay, yeah. Uh, we've got uh, Michael Hines. You know what? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to splash out. We're going to do uh, Blake Gonzalez at 175 notes an hour. Right, okay. Yeah, full cost, 245 quid an hour. That doesn't get as many hours, does it? No, but it might be enough to record She Sells Sanity. Okay. All right, well, right, what's this? Now, uh, adjust the amount of time to spend on the recording by moving the slider. This adjusts the quality level as well as the cost of the recording. Oh, what? Uh, yeah, that's 245 quid, which gets us a 4% recording. Yeah. If I want to, you know, pump it up there, it's five large. <sighs> Let's let's not let's ease that ease that back down. Five hundred quid. Yeah, yeah. Okay, five hundred quid for an eight percenter. All right, done deal. Punch it. Stick that one in the can. Yeah, can it? There you go. Peachy. Uh, after you've recorded some songs, you must compile them onto a CD. What's the uh, what's the minimum number? How many, how many songs do you need? All right, create a new CD. Yeah. Okay, yeah. See, She Sells Sanity. Uh, pretty poor song. Very bad recording. Yeah. Choose a cover design. Oh, hello. We haven't got any cover designs. Gotcha. Okay, maybe that's not something for today. Um, yeah, that's that's fine. It's okay. I, 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 this is a learning curve. It's a process. Uh, you must title the CD. Oh, no, I'm not. I'm I'm cancelling the CD. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I definitely want to cancel it. Yeah, back her up. There you go. Right. We are going to record one more, but we'll change the producer. Uh, we'll do it for Freezer. Uh, now then, uh, let's put something by Coldplay. It's a song I don't care about. It's just there to appease the uh, the audience, really. And that's got us to ten percent recording for three hundred and fifty notes. Ah, interesting. All right, well, what if, uh, yeah, yeah, you see, that there comes a point where it can't go any higher. All right, so seven hours of recording, yeah. yeah gets us top notch. Done. Yep, donezo. Dunnage. Dunzo. Nice. I'm, I'm aiming, I'm going to aim for a CD single, I think, uh, which means I need one more recording, and then I'm going to need some artwork for it. Unless it doesn't let you do a CD single, of course, in which case... I won't be doing that. Uh, Stella's fresh out of ideas. Stella, you're a drummer. It's fine. I don't expect you to have too many ideas. Um, right. Uh, and then if, if this is a CD single, we just need something throwaway uh, to stick on the B side. On the This is the B side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, uh, so what's the A side? Worse. Oh, I see. Okay, fine. We're, we're still maxed at 14%. Stella, the drummer, is about to get a lesson in spending all her points on recording skills. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Having an in-band producer, I think, would uh, would work marvels, and it will certainly save us a bunch of wedge. Uh, we can, I mean, we can go out and win competitions all day, but uh, right, I know we need a studio, uh, uh, an artist. I need an artist. Who have we got? Jacqueline. Yeah, you sound like our kind of artistry. Uh, let's go in there. Buying art is very good for the morale of the musicians in your band. Yes. And you can hang it on the walls at home. Not interested. That said, what have we got? Rocks in water. Mm. Um, we've then got foggy vineyard. Really, I'd call that sticks. Next one, lady. Silhouette in the lake. Lovely. Uh, the next one is uh, desert anomaly. Nice. Sandy ball. Okay. Uh, and then you've got 
barn. Well, okay, I, I mean, there's not much else you could call. Lighthouse. Yep. Uh, and then you've got uh, Metal Tree, four of four. Is it a limited edition? Are there only four of them? Oh, we might buy that. We might collect them. Okay, Sunflowers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Home Sweet Home Sign. Oh, dear. Uh, base Close Up. You sure? Now, I mean, judging on how close the... Uh, uh, the fingerboard is there to the body. I would say that's possibly a cello. Um, anyway, uh, Floating Baby Man. I don't think that's going to inspire us somehow. No, that's it. From here on, we are collecting the metal tree imagery. Yeah. XP all round, and all it cost was money. I like it. But you know what? What? The gallery is not where we're going to get our album art. Oh, that's a very good point. Well, where are we going to get our album art? Full map. Um, choice printing? No. Feels on Marshall's photography. Oh, this sounds this sounds too good to be true. All right, Marshall. Uh, how about you get your camera out? We'll stay here styling. Oh, we can we can play with all the buttons here. Yeah. Does this mean we can have eight members of the band? No, there's eight different positions you can put people in. I'm not entirely sure what's going on. Yeah. Uh, get out. Yeah. And again, get out. I like it. Get out. That's clearly the mood I'm in. We're not really a brick wall kind of a band, though. Ancient Ruins. Hold on. Let's have a look. Oh, no. No, no, no. No. Um, Stella, what are you doing? No, uh, no, we're not feeling that rubble. Yes, well, we are punk rock, and therefore, oh, this is much more like, uh, look at this. Stella's flipping, ready to roll. I'm the business, I, although I don't know what all this hand action is. Uh, talk to me about uh, skylights. Ugh. Mm. Yeah. Moody. Moodier. A post-apocalyptic? Oh, yeah. Brightness. I think we might have a winner. No, no, no. Uh, no, I want uh, I want a bit of brightness, right? Yeah, but wang the contrast up, sweet. Uh, Colour, down, 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 please. Thank you. Bloom, yes, please. Oh, look at it. Um, yeah, now I need some, some more posing here. I think uh, there is definitely, well, that's some vignette. Yes. I'm feeling it. Yeah. Okay. I like how I'm front and center, although I shouldn't be. I'm the bass player. Uh, I could be over here at number five. Can you, if you, if I just click on, if, if I, how do I move you? Oh, no, what's, what have we got going on here? What's, what's this? Click a musician on the left to adjust the properties for him. Thank you. Uh, I'm guessing not. Okay. Yeah. Photo album. Yeah. No. No. Okay. Well, that didn't really come off. Let's try it again. Uh, click. Read it properly. Click a musician in the view on the left to adjust. Okay. We'll do. There we go. Ah. Oh, oh, ah. Oh, love it. Right. You. Spot five. Mm, spot six. Oh, there you go. Spot six. I'm a long way back, and I'm the pretty one. Um, so, no, I get spot four, I think. Yes. Oh, yeah, asymmetrical album cover. Oh, I'm... I'm in, Sorry, I just, I'm, I'm into this. Uh, right, stance is currently stance. What about that one? No. This one? Oh! Oh! Yeah! Oh, lo oh I'm loving it. Uh, okay, right, uh, I don't, body rotation, let's do a bit of that. Yeah, yeah, oh, oh, I'm there, oh, I'm so into it. Um, brilliant, yeah, look at the camera, look at the camera. All right, don't, look where you're going. Oh, well, look where you like. Uh, Stella, we're moving you. Uh, you're going to spot number one. Yeah. Does this work? No. Uh, but, well, give it time. This one? Mm, that one. That. Mm. Oh, I once caught a fish this big. 
Uh, and then uh, that way. Yes. Um, I'm not I'm not overly sold on this composition, it has to be said. Uh, but I think I've got Stella. I, I think this uh, backs to the camera job is a is a winner. Stella, right, moving you. Dabbing. Oh, beautiful. Oh, it's oh, it's more than I ever could have dreamed. Uh, I need to move now. I need to go to spot three. Right. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. D we're workshopping the project. Pe oh, would you just? I'm into it. Uh, okay. Is there anything else I need to do? Edge distortion. Show me. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait. Wait. Keep waiting for it. Okay. Yeah, no, I like that. Um, that's good. I mean, arguably, we have min-maxed this a little bit. What if we do this with the brightness? That's worse. What if we do that? That's negligible. Um, yeah, camera angle. Hmm. Uh. Yeah. Hmm. Uh. Yeah. Okay, right, no, that's, that's that. That's good. Do We don't want the spots labels anymore. I think we're there. I think we're into it. Yes. And snap my picture. How much do you want? That's that's our album cover. Or, or it, at the very least, that is going to be the cover of our first CD single. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, EP. It's not a CD. It's an EP. Oh, yeah. Oh, smashing. Right. Okay. Let's go uh, whip some up. Do we want it to take any more? No. No, no, no. It's great. We've still got three and a half large left. Uh, let's now go to a studio. I am I am over uh, being fussy about the studios. I don't like any of them. Not one of them is called, like, you know, Murder Deluxe, uh, you know, Death Music uh, Studios. There we go. We'll ca get a Casper, the friendly ghost. And we'll, we'll see if he's got anything uh, worthy of anything. I have parked the van. I have parked the van. Right. Oh, this is a more expensive studio. Gosh. Yeah. No, okay, assemble a CD. Let's go. I'd like to create a new CD, please, an EP. Uh, and uh, oh, it's it's not good. Oh, it's obviously uh, uh, it's the, yeah, Sanity, yep, EP. Brilliant. Choose a cover design. Um. You can design and buy CD covers at local print shops, then choose it here for a release. Should have read that earlier. Right, okay, I'm off. Right, come on, let's go. No, no, they're wasting our time. We're going to the print shop. Uh, flipping. We've got the art done now. We should... Does nobody work on a digital for Hold on, this looks like a print shop. Hello, Oliver. Uh... Hello, band t-shirts. No, CD covers. Yes. Right, add photo. Yep, that one. Boom shakalaka. Anything else? Add a graphic. Ooh. Uh, firearms. Mm. Misc. I think we live in misc. Oh, look at it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, budget. No, budget has not. Has, no, we need, we need like... Uh, we need something. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna make this work. All right, okay, I like it. Budget, the Sanity EP, beautiful, loving it, absolutely beautiful. Um, assuming, of course, that I can't. Yeah, I want it. Yes, please. Good. I don't, this is uh, the Sanity EP. Assuming, of course, I'm allowed to put out a three tracker. Uh, <clears throat> if I can't, I'm gonna have to record some more tunes. Ah, that's fair enough. I mean, I'm up for recording more tunes. I think I've got the. Uh, I've got the best of the idea of the notion of the system of the how it works now. A gig banner. We totally need that. Now I had picked out, I think it was I think it was font number 70 something. Or was it? Was it a higher font? I didn't say, save the design, did I? Oh good. Uh, right, uh, budget is font number 118. Thank you. That's our that's our band font now. Is it? Yeah, budget. Sweet. Uh, and then what colour is that? It's black, obviously. I mean, are you new here? Background colour, black. Uh, our colour, almost black. And then we add a graphic, because uh, that's important. Splatters, yes. Uh, this one, please, because it looks like a little man having a dance. All right, seek help. Uh, right, and then that moves down a layer. Yeah, that goes down like that. 
Uh, we make that uh, slight... No, wait, no, wrong one. All right, hold on, element, elephant color, that one. Yep, size, yes, please. Budget. See, that's, I mean, that's really everything you need to say about the band. Uh, yeah, thank you. Do I want to buy a banner of this? I do. Uh, this is the budget. Budget banner. Yes. One. Nice. Yeah. No, I, I think uh, that's the way they are. Let's leave. I am now ready to assemble my CD. Okay, create new CD. Yes. CD title is The Sanity EP. I think we've established this. The track list. Uh, song number one, Sanity. Song number two, Coldplay. Song number three, Brenda. Beautiful. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Beautiful. Release the CD? Yeah. We're going to release the CD. Are we though? Yes, we are. Release it. Are you sure you want to release the CD projects entitled The Sanity EP with three tracks? Yes, I am. There you go. Uh, if, the, if the CD you just released is for a record contract, then it will be sold automatically each week. You should still sock up on your new CD to sell it at gigs for extra cash, regardless of whether it was recreased, re recorded or vice versa. Okay. Yep. Buy me some seeds. Uh, these, please. Uh, gig sale price. Yeah, I want to buy some. Click to buy. Two bucks each. We sell them for a tenner. Uh, I reckon we can do a hundred. Yeah, let's do a ton of them. Yeah, they're going to be a flipping collector's item. Oh my goodness. The Sanity EP. We've got an EP. I like it. Right, we've got a gig to go see. All right, and then, uh, well, we're going to go do some practice. Uh, and then we've got a gig to go see. And then we've got another battle of the bands. And I want to see how many of these we can sell. Uh, the word on the street is that budget may be the next big thing. I I rather think so. I rather think so. Right, we've got a battle of the Banes to go to this evening. That's, uh, that's super. Um, how did we get on? Coldplay's pretty much there. Coldplay's pretty much there. We can debut it at the Battle of the Banes. Evening, cheerful. How's it going? Welcome. Hello. I'd rather see your band up there. You are absolutely... Hey, you're not looking so good. What? Why don't you go home and get some rest? No, hush. Maybe even go to the hospital. I don't need to go to the hospital. How am I? I'm fine. I'm fine, honestly. Uh, you giant guy, honestly. They are very sensitive uh, bar staff going on here. Anyway, let's have a let's have a see what this is all about. It's the cheerful air. There's a lot. I mean, they're all female. Apart from the drummer, he's got bad hair. Am I? I mean, they don't look like they're all part of the same band. And obviously they've got one of their younger sisters over there on the keyboard. Can I join your band? What can he play? I can play Mary and a Little Lamb on the piano. Uh, yeah, sure. We're just not going to plug it in. Is that all right? Yeah, all right. And we'll stick a monitor in front of you so you won't be aware that you can't hear anything. We'll tell you that's how it's supposed to be. Anyway, they've got plenty of energy, which is lovely. Uh, right, we've got some XPs. That's good. Uh, the battle winner was the adaptable board, which is great. Uh, we're happy, we're inspired, and we got some rep. Good. We do like it. We do like a little bit of. I don't. I don't understand. Ah, oh, okay. We we got rep with the losers as well. Well, that's decent. Uh, we didn't. Get, oh no, the cheerful air is the name of the pub. Oh yeah. Now that you've achieved seven popularity in Chicago, Illinois. You are no longer qualified for today's battle gig at Marvin's Pub. Say what? No. No, no, no. 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 I mean, I'm, I'm, I don't mind. But at the same time, I really do mind. Oh, no. Oh, no one told me that. I would have been less popular had that been the case. How have I become more popular? Why don't we have a manager yet? Because we haven't got any money, Stella. We're skint. Uh, we, do, we were doing... We were on a winner there with our battle of the banes. We can't we can't play tonight. Oh no. No, we can't. Oh, what are we gonna do? 
let's let's go out and get away well just as kiki tyrant and the budget stellars start to get a handle on okay we're on to we're on to a winner here we can gradually write better tracks but uh in the interim period we can at least win battle of the bands over and over and over again and i'm not allowed to play battle of the bands anymore They've been banging on at me for bam, bam, banging, banging on at me for ages uh, with regard to getting some CDs on the table. I go and make some CDs and they kind of go, oh, yeah, you're not allowed to play anymore. You know, well, I, I don't know. Frankly, I need to know where my next gig's coming from because uh, there's, a, there's a reasonably good chance that next weekend's double bill at Battle of the Bands is going to boot me out as well. I'm going to have to go and get some besuited parasite who's going to represent me to the music industry uh, and uh, and acquire me better gigs and uh, and a recording contract uh, with a with a significant advance non recoupable that's what we're chasing that's what we want we're going places our three piece and uh, it's going to go well i need to give stella a haircut oh yeah 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 stella needs a haircut not uh, not big floppy bouffant hair singer Stella no mullet hair uh, drummer Stella needs a needs a haircut I might make her look exactly like the singer that'd just be mean wouldn't it yeah does that gonna stop me it seems seems fairly unlikely anyway tune in next time and find out exactly how I abuse my singer and drummer and myself the bass player in budget the greatest band in this series.